This local sports report is presented by the Cambridge Minor Football Association. Registration is now open for fall tackle football in all age groups. Sign up now on the Lions website at cambridgelions.ca. Oh, I haven't had to do that in almost two years. I haven't had a haircut in about as long either, but... That's Austin Badger pulling on shoulder pads for the first time since the summer of 2019. The long wait is over for tackle football in Cambridge. Our intensity and excitement should be high, right? This is this is great for us. We haven't been able to do this, all right? Same pad since Pee Wee. Pretty small. Might need to get a new pair, but... Hey, we need to throw them on for tonight. I threw them on and I was ready to go. Cody Highland and the Lions hitting the field for a full contact practice on Monday night. Feel pretty excited. Glad to be back out here with a great group of people who are willing to put in the hard work every Monday, Wednesday, and they're just willing to get out here. They give it their all the whole time. So, and with great coaches, we're going to be great. We've got guys that are going to try to block us. We got guys that are going to try to catch. Normally those two split up two completely different groups, but it's good to finally see everybody who's a part of the organization coming back together to finally play as a group again. Everyone excited getting back to normal. Defensive back Braden Starrett had one of the plays of the night with this interception in 1v1s. First time back out in pads, you know, I'm feeling good. I just gotta make, go out there and make a play. First one-on-one -on -one in pads, so we're all going out there and making plays. The fact that we're here right now in pads, full team, you know, linemen are here too. It's amazing. I mean, uh, it's great, absolutely fantastic to be back. I mean, most of these athletes, Darren, have been working out for 18 months straight. They haven't given up, so they're looking for a football season as soon as they can get to it, right? Steve Amos is the president of the Cambridge Minor Football Association. He says fall registration is open for the younger age groups. The Lions have also opened registration for a high school tackle league this fall. You can secure a spot with a deposit. However, the high school league is contingent on whether local school boards give the green light or hold off when it comes to the return of high school athletics. Fall football for the minor programs, full board, just like we've always done, traditionally done. Um, you know, the, the minors, uh, you know, we've got a U8 program that'll be non-contact just for the little guys starting out. Uh, U10, U12, U14, which is, you know, traditionally we would call Adam, Pee Wee, Bantam. Um, they're going to play travel football. It'll be it'll be regional. So our, our friends from Waterloo, uh, Guelph, uh, you know, Brantford, Hamilton, Burlington are probably all going to be in the mix. And then we'll have playdowns, provincial playdowns at the end of the season. So, so that's fantastic. And and uh, we're um, for we've got every contingency you know covered with the junior varsity guys, senior varsity guys. It's U16 and U18 plus. Basically, we're registering a football season for the high school age guys for the fall on the contingency that there's you know that that Waterloo Region does not run a, a, foot, a football program. So we certainly hope the, the high schools are, are able to run a program. You know that's ideal. We'd like to see these boys playing high school ball with their with their schools. But if they're not, we're gonna have a, a football season here in Cambridge, and and we'll be working with our friends up in Waterloo. So Summer development, fall tackle football, and a ton of energy at the Jake. Yes, things are very positive around the Lions these days, and it's awesome to see. Alrighty, boys, Lions on me, Lions on three. One, two, three, Lions! For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.